guys you welcome back to my youtube channel in this video i'm going to show us how to make tomato paste tomato paste is made with fresh tomatoes and other ingredients that i'm going to show you keep watching as i'm going to show you all the ingredients that you can use in making this tomato paste this tomato paste can be stored in the refrigerator this tomato paste can last as long as you can store it. So, keep watching as I'm going to show you all the ingredients. This is fresh tomatoes. This is what we are going to use to have tomato paste. This is fresh pepper. This is another ingredient for this tomato paste. This is ginger and garlic. Remember, whenever we want to make tomato paste, we must have ginger and garlic so that we'll have a nice flavor. I also have here chopped onions. These are the ingredients for having tomato paste. First thing we are going to do, we are going to start blending the tomatoes. We are going to add the tomatoes, fresh pepper, onions, ginger and garlic, and then blend it together before we start blending we have to add the pepper onions and ginger and garlic together and blend it first before the tomatoes after blending everything nicely you can see it I'm going to transfer it into the pot And then boil it the fresh tomato is now on the fire it's going to boil until it is dry why I'm making this tomato paste is because most of my videos I do make use of tomato paste and so many people do ask how do you get the tomato paste that is why I have decided to make this tomato paste so that you can see it and also prepare it it is very easy and fast The fresh tomato is cooking well. This is how it's going to be cooked until it is dried. Then we remove it, put it in a covered plate and store it in the fridge. You can see that the tomato is getting dried. This is how it's going to be cooked until it is well dried. The tomatoes is getting dried. We are going to allow all the water in this tomato to dry up before we put it down and allow it to cool the tomatoes is dried enough and so i'm going to put it down and allow it to cool before we transfer it into a container that has cover and then store it in the fridge this is how the tomato looks like i'm going to transfer it into the container i hope you have seen how i make my tomato paste so many people do ask, how do you get your tomato paste? That is the reason why I have decided to prepare this tomato paste so that you can see it and prepare it also at home. After putting it in this plate, I'm going to cover it and store it in the fridge. So it is going to be easy to use it whenever you need it. If you love this video, don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Also share this video with your family and friends. See you in my next video. Bye.